face. He looked like a man had lived a hard life. The hurt of it showed on his face. Hungry for food showed through his loose clothes. You could tell one was tailored a bit. A distant look that was in his eyes, as if he'd just seen hell fiery pit. When I first spoke to him, it seemed that he didn't hear the sound. I thought he might be dead. But then he turned around. He looked like he wanted to say something, but couldn't speak. I got him by the arm and I said, would you like to talk to me? With a voice that was shaking, soft and low. He said, you look like an old friend of mine. Someone from long, long ago. I said, they tell me that there's a place not far from here where they pray and sing and God answers prayer. But I can't seem to find it by myself. Would you walk with me over there? And as we walk towards that little church house, we stop along the way. Just listen to the church bells ring out. God's holy day. And as I walked into that sacred place, I felt I was all alone with God. The friend that I had been talking to had gone away. But when I knelt to pray, it was all so plain to see that the friend that I've been talking to was my own soul inside of me. And for the first time, I found myself inside myself. And with God's helping hands, the master of the universe. Lord, I want to thank you for finding this man.